<laughs> hello hello friends today's video is a different one I'm letting everybody know that it's come to the time where I'm probably not going to put out weekly videos I've been doing this for nearly three years now and I've had so much fun and I really do feel like I have made some friends across all areas of the world um, through the comments in the description. Some people that spring to mind that I want to shout out today is of course the one and only original Mike from Texas. Mike's been around pretty much since I started doing regular videos of Arlo and he's been cheering me on ever since. So I really do appreciate your support, Mike. Uh, I haven't heard much from Ren recently. I don't know, Ren, if you continue to watch any of my videos. However, you were definitely around right at the start as well. And um, I really appreciated all that support when I first started this um, regular uploading. There's a handful of other people that have just been um, present repeatedly over the years with comments and support and I just appreciate it so much and uh, Mick is one of them uh, we have similar dogs and I've had a little bit of um, advice from you which has been really helpful and I appreciate that so much um, so thank you so much for being a, a friend of Arlo <laughs> and of me as well Jim Marotta, uh, you're a fellow Australian and I know you definitely have Borzoi dogs as well and you've also given me some input in regards to what to expect from a Borzoi dog and um, many people might know that Arlo is my first Borzoi. Uh, my first actual dog was Perry, my beautiful stag hound. Of course, Sheila over in the UK. Sheila, thank you so much for all of your um, comments and well wishes. By the way, watch till the end, Sheila, because I managed to capture some more footage of um, the gravestones that you were talking about. Uh, by the way, this is for Sheila's um, family tree. Uh, there might be a there might be a link uh, and I'm going to put uh, the description in the description box because it might be a little bit tricky to read uh, what is on the gravestones because they're very old so I've um, I went through that today and I'm going to put it all in the description box so I hope that helps you Sheila so thank you so much Unknown Ninja, thank you so much. You are unknown, you're a ninja, you come in, you're very stealthy with your very funny comments. Seriously, every single comment gets a laugh from me and I appreciate it to no end. You have no idea and I swear to you, every time I said I would give Arlo a hug on your behalf, I did that. I would give him a cuddle and say, this is from Unknown Ninja. <laughs> I just want you to know that. Dennis. Uh, Dennis has been commenting quite recently and showing lots of support. And I just want you to know that I really do appreciate that. Uh, we speak different languages. Um and sometimes I hope my translation has come across un to be understood. <laughs> but I just wanted to um, say thank you and I appreciate that. 
Gabriel Cabrera, and I, I'm so sorry, it's either Gabriel or Gabrielle. So, Gabriel Cabrera, and you're another person who has commented quite frequently, um, and I see you and I notice you, and I want to say thank you. I really have always appreciated your comments. And of course, the lovely couple um, somewhere in the US, Mount Shasta. Uh, we chatted and I just hope you two are okay. Uh, I know you've been quiet for a little bit and that's okay. Uh, but just know that I have been thinking about you both and I do um, genuinely uh, really care about you and I even though we've never met you know this is the whole friends and pen pal type of situation which is really lovely and of course my mum <laughs> thanks mum you've been my best fan for all the years and you know how much I appreciate that and Arlo loves to come and visit you and always loves it when you come and visit him as well so I'm not going to not post anymore I will continue to post it might be a little bit different my life at the moment is incredibly busy and taking Arlo for a walk capturing footage I'm very focused on the end product and it's taking me away from the moment if that makes sense to people I want to be more living my life in the moment with Arlo when I'm out and walking and enjoying nature and our bushwalks so um, I might just put up on occasion a little clip something funny probably won't do big long intros um, maybe every now and then when I'm in the mood I'll I will put up a longer relaxing um, walking video with some pleasant music so oh, I've got an Instagram I don't use it uh, I don't post any uh, information on it but I like it because I follow some people and lots of the Instagram channels make me laugh. <laughs> so that's mostly why I look at it. There's lots of animal related stuff, which is really cute as well. But the details are in my YouTube. And, you know, if anyone ever wanted to say hello, then they can do that through my Instagram, which is at the Angie Rival. So that's just the way it is. So I just want everybody to know how much I have appreciated all of your comments. And if I missed anyone who commented frequently, then I apologize. But I, you know, I, I think I always made an effort to reply directly and I always appreciated the communication that we had in the comments section. So um, here we are. <laughs> Big cuddles. My gorgeous pop. Big puppy. Aren't you? Yes. He's got the longest nose. He has the longest nose, doesn't he? Yeah? <laughs> like I said, I will keep posting, but just not on a regular weekly basis as I have done for, I think, the last two and a half years. I need a little bit of a break, all right? I hope that's okay. And I know I've got a tiny channel. <laughs> I've got a tiny channel, but I just want to make sure that people know how much I have appreciated all of my subscribers and all of the people who have been active with their communications on the channel and motivating to keep me going for so long so um till next time 
farewell and I hope everyone is safe and well wherever you are in the world and well I'll see you soon bye bye Every time I wake up, I feel like it's Monday. Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain. All of a sudden, I don't look at anything the same way. Gotta build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray. I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay? Just let me be me and I'll stay out of your way. I can see the way you look at me, I'm such a disgrace. I never really asked to be brought into this place. You wanna love me? Well then, baby, have a taste. All the highs and the lows, no, you'll never be the same. I don't really wanna hurt you, but I can't control the pain. If you're sticking by my side, maybe we could be okay. Okay, okay, maybe you could be the change I need today. I promise that I've never felt this way. I really hope that you will choose to stay through all the pain. I know you told your friend you're not okay. And tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way. Cause you're trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away. But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to gray as you fade away.